up, guys? My dad's here. He's mad at me. He's yelling at me because he's taking pictures down already. I didn't even get to see them one last time. You took this too already? And it's on my queen bed. He's yelling at me, but he's not gonna do it anymore for the video, but he's yelling at me. Oh, Dad, I wanted to see it a little longer. <sighs> my dad is here today to help me take things off the walls. This is the last day we're gonna see the house looking full. Let's all say goodbye together. I'm so sad. Oh my God. I'm going. I know. See, he's... You can take pictures. I won't take any more pictures off the wall. I'm gonna, I'm gonna uh, miss everything. Get to your I know, I have to go. <sighs> I'm gonna miss it all. Hi guys. <laughs> this is the last time I'm gonna see my beautiful table for years because it's not gonna fit in New York. Can I live? You're still gonna be a kitty in the city. In the big city now. Oh, how about that? I'll help you take that down. No, not now. See? You got your appointment. <laughs> I know, I have to get the COVID shot. I don't want this COVID shot. I'm doing it for my family. I don't know how you guys feel about it, but that's my thought. Let's say goodbye to the house. I do not feel prepared for any of what's happening whatsoever. I am so overwhelmed. Every single day has been jam-packed with things that's going on like back to back to back to back. My mind has been running and going crazy. I feel uneasy like having my dad there at my house right now by himself doing that stuff. Because as you can see, I got home and he already started taking everything off the walls. I'm like, what are you doing? Like, I didn't even get to walk him through it. I wanted to, I don't know. I don't know what's gonna happen. By the time I get home, my whole freaking house is gonna be taken apart. He has more anxiety than I do about getting this done in time. I'm going to get my COVID shot right now, the second one, and I didn't wanna get it, but I'm getting it. For family, friends, and other people in the world, it's gonna make my life easier too, I think, during the move. Got it, didn't want it. And I'm not here trying to convince people to get it, so you do exactly what you wanna do and what you're comfortable with. Oh, I was gonna pretend to faint, <laughs> but I was like, nah, that's kinda messed up. You know what's awesome? Sometimes I feel like you see things and it's a sign. Literally, that notebook that said start by starting. I went for a run today and I was thinking about that and I wanted to talk to you guys, give you a little inspiration. I'm nervous, I am so nervous to move to New York and I'm starting by starting. I'm doing it out of fear, but excitement. If there's anything that you guys ever wanna do, you just literally have to start. But in the meantime, I'm stopping at this spot that has like the best cannolis in the whole city. My cousin used to live right up the block and we used to get them all the time. Here's the cannolis. Oh my God. They look so good and they overflowed them. These have big anchors. They're going to be bigger holes. It's going to take one first coat of spackle. That's got to dry completely. How, long, how many days, how long does it have to dry? 24 hours. Watch if I get TV. the first coat of spackle on everything today, then I can get a second coat tomorrow. And, and the hell with a third coat. It's not going to get that done or that perfect. Unless I have to, if it looks really shitty. You know, there's going to be whole, that's a lot of work. This whole's all over. I don't watch Whoa. TV anymore. You don't watch TV, you don't have the f***ing <laughs> cable. Honey, this stuff has got to come down. I got to spread all this everything. Jesus, I, I didn't even get a chance to, to, to see it again. Well, take pictures now, girl, because they're coming down. Uh, Those are my YouTube pictures. Let me get the boxes for them. They're in the storage. Well, they're heavy. These are coming down. They're heavy. This TV's got to come down. I no. I know. This bathroom's down. Jesus, where are we putting all this stuff? I don't know. I'm thinking a lot of this stuff, we can move or pack ourselves because you don't want them to say they're going to create this damn thing. I yeah. know. Like he's vlogging. This is his pool. And he was showing me the video. 
Excuse me, Pat. Hi. This is our pool. We just took the cover off, and you can see it's kind of green and disgusting. It's empty, really. Are you swimming in that dirty green water? No, it was sitting all winter long. Oh. And it's at least 12 years. We paid about $400 for it, so we got our money's worth out of it. It's all rusting apart. Normally, we would drain it like this. Who are you talking to? <laughs> Your audience? <laughs> open it. but this year we're going to do it a different way here is my trusty old stanley knife and we're going to drain it the fast way see what happens that's nothing here we go So that's it. Yeah. That was cool. Wow, my dad did a good job vlogging. <laughs>